Outrocast. Well, my first question for both of you, and I'll throw it to Waleed first. When did you know that the show was going to be coming back for a season two? You know, I didn't, and this is embarrassing, but I didn't even know about Gangs of London until I got the audition because it just, you know, with everything going on with the pandemic and, and it, it not being as big of a of a thing here in the U.S. I mean, like, you know, I just didn't. So anyway, um, I right after I sent in my tapes, I asked to see season one and then instantly I just became a huge fan of the series. And I was like, wow. Um, and even before I even got the episodes, I, while I was waiting for them, I was just started Googling the show and I saw all these interviews from the creators and the stars. And I was just like, I just fell in love with everybody. So I, I just couldn't wait to jump in and be a part of this incredible, you know, to join the gangs. Same question at you. Sorry for the lack of an original question. For me? Okay, so, well, I was in gang, uh, in, in season one. Um, yes. How it happened for me, it was very funny because I met Car uh, Kelly Hendry, the casting director, like a year prior to Gangs of London being cast. And she told, like, we had this lovely meeting and she told me about the project. She was like, oh, I'm casting this project. There was a role, her name is Lale. She's like super badass. I think you'd be perfect for it. And I was like, oh, wow, that sounds amazing. Because I'm a big Sopranos fan and, you know, yeah. God, and all that. So, <laughs> oh, my God, what a dream. And then, you know, as an actor, you, you hear things and then you're like, okay, in and out. You don't want to think about it because you don't want to go there too many times. It doesn't happen. So, um, and then literally a year later, I get the audition request. And I'm like, wow, she really rem uh, remembered. And um I auditioned and I got the part. And the rest you know, is history. <laughs> uh, it's history, yes. Yeah. Two quick questions and then I'll let you both go. Uh, first one, this is a very dramatic, action-packed show, but who's the funniest person in the cast? Because of course, when they say cut, some jokes have to happen. Hmm. Oh, from season one and two, I would say, right? Yes. For me, Joe Cole, he is so funny. Oh my God, he should be a comedian. Like he could, he could be a comedian, this guy. He is so funny. Waleed, same question at you. You know, I'd have to agree, honestly. Joe and I really, really hit it off and we have a very similar, sick, you know, weird sense of humor. And we just had so much fun. And it was like all the stuff that was happening between the takes. Um, um, and um, yeah, I mean, Joe for sure. Uh, I'm trying to think who else. Uh, we'll go with Joe, if both of you are in agreement there. And the last question before I let you go, obviously, Gangs of London is the best show on AMC+. Plus. We know that, it's a fact. But what's the second best show on AMC+, Plus for both or either of you? Um, Get that network corporate synergy going. Okay. So... Is is so the Breaking Bad and Better Call Saul mm -hmm. that falls into the yeah yeah I'm I'm a huge fan of Breaking Bad uh, uh, I'm a huge fan of The Walking Dead the the first three seasons which I had seen and then I kind of fell off but Better Call Saul I'm now catching up and I'm like in season three and I'm like a huge huge fan um, so yeah it kind of is a tie between those three <laughs> yeah I agree those three Breaking Bad for me is number one. For sure. And then there was this other show about the, um, I forgot the title, sorry. But um, hey, those are great recommendations. And I thank you both for your time and hope to see you both in a season three. No spoilers, no spoilers. Outrocast.